Hi there, you may have noticed that when you use your Windows search box, it doesn't always find the files, folders or programs you search for on your computer. This is because by default, Windows search is only set up to look in certain places on your computer. But today I'm going to show you how to make a few simple changes so that your Windows search box can find any file, any folder and any program on your computer. So here's how to do it. Click in the search box, type control panel, then press enter. Make sure large icons is selected, then click on indexing options. Next, click on modify. Notice that the main hard drive, which is the C drive, is not selected. So put a tick in the box next to the C drive. This will ensure that next time you use the Windows search box, it will include the search results from your entire main hard drive. If you have any other hard drives, you can also include those as well. You can even include external hard drives. In this example, I've included my main hard drive, a second internal hard drive, and an external hard drive. So the next time I use the Windows search box, it will find files, folders and programs from all three of those hard drives. You can include or exclude any of the options in this top box. For example, I'm going to deselect Internet Explorer history because I don't want any of that to show up whenever I do a search. Once you've finished here, click on OK. Next, click on Advanced, then File Types. This is a list of all the file types that will be included in the Windows search results. It's extremely likely that this list has covered every type of file you have on your computer, as this list has well over 700 file types. But just in case you have a very unusual type of file on your computer that you want to include, but isn't on the list, you can add it just here, then click Add. Next, click on Index Settings, then Rebuild, to allow Windows to build your new search index, then click on OK. You can see your new index being built at the top of this window. This can take quite a while to complete, but you can carry on using your computer whilst it automatically runs in the background. If you turn your computer off before the list has been rebuilt, Windows will automatically pause the index in for you and then will automatically resume it when you turn your computer back on. Any files, folders or programs that you add to your computer, now or in the future, will be added to the Windows indexing list automatically. Once Windows has finished rebuilding the index, it will say index incomplete just here. From that point forward, your search box will then show you anything that you're looking for on your computer and it will find it extremely fast as well. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you next time.